Today I would begin with divine source theory. The divine source theory basically assumes that the language is a gift from God. According to the Muslims' perception, the merciful who taught Quran and created man and gave him his speech in Surah Rahman. However, Veda's perception is different from Quranic perception. They consider, considered Goddess Saraswati is the mother of language. However, biblical allusion says that God created Adam, whatsoever Adam called every creature that was the name thereof. However, some critics experimented over that and they kept a child in an isolation with a mute shepherd. And they observed that the child acquired the word because which was an Egyptian word so that they considered Egyptian language is a mother language of all languages. And some critics viewed it as an imitation of God's grunt, as the child was not in utter isolation. And uh, this theory paved the way for natural sound source theory.